Kesha to a tribe called Quest. Oh, that's so easy. What's up, you're watching Hi Mind, the most fried show on the internet. My name is Riley Zodrin, my soft-boiled co-host, Graydon. I'm an egg. And today we're doing a brand new game. This is... Spotify Related Artist Speed Run. Where we try to get from one artist to another artist using only their related artists on Spotify. Now we've wanted to do this game for a while, but logistically, we don't know much. No. And then came along Relatal.io, created by a Hivemind fan, Kareem Kalani, and his brother, Zaid Kalani. So there's a game that you can play where there's a daily matchup, much like Wordle, but you can also make custom matchups in the game, which Grant has done for us to try to solve. Just moments before we're filming this, we sat in here individually and did half the matchups each, creating a score to beat for each matchup. So on the first one, Graydon's already done it. I'm gonna know his score and I'm gonna try to beat that. Whoever gets to the destination artist in the least amount of moves gets the point. And it's not infuriating. At all. <laughs> it's a fun, simple game. Me versus Graydon versus you. The Kalani brothers. They made the game. I feel like they might be too good for us. We'll see about that. <laughs> all right, before we get into it, make sure you like the video, subscribe if you want to see more. HiMindTV.com for our merch. We also got brand new merch over on Cope's website, which is linked in description. It's on the screen right now. Also linked in description is our Patreon and our Cameo. If you'd like to support us or click the join button here on YouTube and become a member. Now, before we get into the video, today's video is brought to you by our sponsor, Scentbird. I'll tell you more about Scentbird later in the video. Thank you, Scentbird. Smells good in here. Last thing before we start, all of the individual footage is gonna be up on our Patreon. So us trying to solve them in the room alone, that you can watch on our Patreon for only $5 a month. That's getting released? That is gonna be released to the public. Oh. Well, it's behind a paywall. Oh shit. Okay, cool. Albeit a shallow paywall, $5 a month. I mean, yeah. yeah. Cool. All right, Grant, what's the first matchup? Travis Scott to the Kid Leroy. Okay, and what's my score to beat? 14. 14, okay. Yeah, this is when I thought it was all fun and games. <laughs> so Travis Scott to Kid Leroy. I know both those artists. It's going to be fun. So I've got Travis Scott to the Kid Leroy. I'm going to try to get to Juice World. That's going to be my, my thing here. That's where my head was at. <laughs> okay, I'll start with Lil Uzi Vert. I also hit two on accident in this one. I do just want to say that. Yeah, it seems made up. My big oh, wait. greasy thumbs. <laughs> Lil Tekka's here. Lil Tekka and Lil Leroy have a lot of songs together. Not on his related artists, though. Let's do Lil TJ, though. That seems like a good move. I fucked up. You fucked up. Did I? You're going to want to get to Twista. That's how I got there. <laughs> yeah, totally. Once I found Twista, I knew it. All right, well, I went to Lil Mosey, which I feel like now I'm really on the right track because I got 24K Golden and Ian Dior here, and that's going to get me there, I think. Yeah, it sure did. Boom, six guesses. <laughs> yeah. Really good run, man. Thanks, man. How many did you do again? 14. 14, okay. And that by far was the fastest one I got. Oh. By far. Thanks for spoiling that. Uh, who gets the point? You do. Oh, okay. I get the point. What was the fastest route? The fastest route was four guesses, and that was Travis Scott to Don Tolliver to Internet Money to Ian Dior to the Kid Leroy. It's cool, though, that on Relatal, it does show you the fastest way yeah, to get there. Yeah, sick. Especially when you have one that's like 100 guesses or right. something, and then you look back and you're like, ah, I could have got it in six. <laughs> I like that. Mm -hmm. I like when it does that. You're like a tiny little bitch. And I like that. Yeah, you told me that I had the body of a woman earlier. Yeah, fantastic. <laughs> fantastic. <laughs> and then you told me that you couldn't fit my belt around your neck. It won't even fit up my arm. It's not true. Your belt couldn't even be a wristwatch for me. I am massive. Yeah, give it a few months, maybe. Hmm. Okay, yeah. All right, Grant, what is my destination? Taylor Swift to Baby Keem. T-Swift to Baby Keem. And the score to beat? Whatever. What is it? 49. Oh God, that doesn't bode well for me. <laughs> yeah, I didn't do well on this one. If you like watching me suffer and scream, this is gonna be a great game for you. <laughs> yeah, it's it's not often that before the video even starts, you're a broken man. Oh, I am irate. You right were now. yelling. Watch the Patreon footage. I am <laughs> fucking, oh, fuck that shit, dude. <laughs> fuck this game. I love you guys, the Colony brothers. You guys are great. Great dudes. Gay Lonnie. Gay yeah. Lonnie. Great dudes, but yeah. this is some fuck. This is fucking torture. Where am I gonna go? Does Selena Gomez have a song with Baby Keem? No. Harry Styles sure as fuck doesn't. He's never even rapped. Sean Mendez looks angelic in his 
Spotify photo. I'm gonna go with Ariana. Okay, that gets me Doja Cat. I feel like I'm I'm on a heater already. Yeah, fuck you, Riley. I'm all over this shit. Conan Gray. <laughs> <laughs> no thanks. Melanie Martinez, though. <laughs> I got Nicki Minaj, Cardi B, Megan The Stallion, and Olivia Rodrigo. Kind of like the queens of women rap. <laughs> Baby Keem's got a song. He's got a song with Kendrick. So does Nicki Minaj, so I'll go there. Do they have a song together? Bitch, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> man, Baby Keem's sick, man. <laughs> Woo, I'll go Megan The Stallion. Can I get a dude up in here? <laughs> Bad baby. She's so bad. Not like that. Like she's a bad baby. You know what I mean? Bad baby. I guess. All right, dude. Yeah, man. Let's go. Ugh. Let's go with her. That'll do something. Uh-oh. There's a dude. Yeah, that's Miguel. Miguel. But will that even get me closer? <laughs> it's got to. We got to go into the males. Wale is a rapper. Yep. He's here. Mm -hmm. Yep. I think I'll go Wale. <sighs> when I said it, I didn't like it. Wale to Rich Homie Quan. <laughs> oh, shit, man. I guess I'll go Rick Ross. And then from Rick Ross, oh, I could go Young Money. <laughs> <laughs> you sure could. I really just want to get to Kendrick, right? Sure. Is that what, like, you were aiming for? That's what I was aiming for, yeah. I'll go Meek Mill. And Meek Mill didn't really get me anywhere. Maybe I'll go Nipsey Hussle, LA. And then I'm feeling like Big Crit, maybe. J-Rock. I'll go J-Rock. Okay. I got Pusha T on here. I got Isaiah Rashad. I feel like I got to go with the label. Oh, Schoolboy Q was there. I should have went there. Joey Badass and Vince Staples are here. Those are kind of the way I'm leading. I'll go Vince. I might be able to get there without getting to Kendrick at this point, I'm kind of thinking. I'll go Denzel Curry. Now we're at J.I.D., Corday, Earl. I think I'll go J.I.D. Bing, Baby Keen. <laughs> yeah. Nice, 16. That was well played. Wow. And the fastest route was five, and it was Taylor Swift to O-Rod to Doja to Kelly, Uchis to Tyler to Baby Keem. Yeah, that makes sense. My favorite thing in seeing the fastest route is the first move. Like, what's the totally. what's the initial dive, and if I was right or wrong, and I wouldn't have gone to O-Rod, but it kind of makes sense. The youth. So it is one-to-one. -one. Despite how infuriated you are with this game. Still am. You're still upset with it? Yeah, I mean, maybe, like, I'll just do better at your matches, and now you're going to get to feel my pain of how hard my matches were. <laughs> right, I did. I did beat you in your matchup, though, first. That was nothing, brother. <laughs> I hate to say it, but I thought the same thing. That was like light work. That was like a tickle on the nose. <laughs> You're about to get sucker punched in the throat. Grant's got some evil up his sleeve. I've played this game, though. Like, I've been doing it daily. Yeah, me too. Have you? <laughs> hey, there's no way. There's no way you have. It's just uh, not something you would play. I don't play games. <laughs> I know. You're not phone games. No, I play Call of Duty and I scream at teenagers. <laughs> exactly. I can tell that. Fuck you. I can hear your dad in the back. He sounds like a bitch. Yeah, that's, yeah. I know. I've heard you say that. I feel like that's the beautiful thing is like our videos are, you know, you're funny and likable and all those things. And then sometimes there's got to be a video that breaks the mold and shows them the rage that's trapped deep inside. Ah! Of you. Because you are like I'm a tormented being. You get irritated easily. Quit grinding my gears. I'm not trying to grind you. Seriously. See. I'm see trying these? to display. I'm see these? Peace and justice. I'm trying to show people what's on display in this video. It's a beautiful dynamic. You're a layered person. You're Peace complex. Justice. <laughs> Peace and justice. Whatever, dude. You want to put 100 bucks on this game? Easily. Okay. Let's make it 20. <laughs> 100 bucks. 50. 25. 30. You're going to beat me. I know. You got that look in your 25. eyes. 25. 25 bucks. It's on. <laughs> right. Let's go. All right. For free dinner. <laughs> Your dinner only costs 25 bucks. Poor. I'm not <laughs> poor. I'm frugal. Oh, okay. There's a difference between poor and frugal. That's true. All right, bitch. What's next? Oh, sorry. <laughs> uh, what's up, Grant? What's up, guys? What's up, man? Me and Boss? Grant will kick your ass. You couldn't. Yep. He would literally just sit on your back and I could punch your face. <laughs> and you would be like, yeah. I just got skin surgery. Oh. Sorry. They replaced it with like lobster shell. <laughs> tink, tink. I'm indestructible, basically. They said there's a few things. They said to stay away from Kroger. Yeah, well, I'll get you. Basically indestructible to human punches. I am getting the claws next week though, and then it's over. Cause right now I got good defense and I gotta work on my offense. B boss, boss Grant, what's next? Eminem to falling in reverse. Oh, love it. What's the score to beat? 13. Oh, I did that one in 13. It seemed so easy in the beginning. Yeah, I don't know how you were in here for so long. Eh, you'll see. <laughs> <laughs> so starting off here, we got Eminem's related artists. I'm going to have to go down to, for some reason, Post Malone's on here. <laughs> I'm going to take him. That was a bad move. I no, can tell already. No, it's not. Don't tell. I don't like clues no, and it's not. shit. It was actually an awesome move. 
move. Okay, it was the best first move you could make. Logic. Okay, now I got Joiner Lucas, then to GEZ. I'm uh, hoping for NF. Or Hobson might be a good move. Or Lil Dicky. It might be a sneak good move there. I don't think, I don't know. I went with Lil Dicky. Brother, you gotta get to bands. You gotta get to some bands. Fuck off, man. Broke ass. I know I'm broke, man. It was like the first the other day. I had to pay all my shit. I am gonna go with Oliver Tree here. Fuck yeah. Love Oliver Tree's music. I know you do. You're a huge, so awesome. huge fan of him. Ghost Mane. Nice. That's where exactly where I would have gone. <laughs> Suicide Boys. Ah, I wouldn't have gone there. Lil Pete. Nice. I don't like where I'm at. Feel like I'm gonna lose this matchup. X, only five more. Yeah, I'm lost here. 25 bucks gonna braid my hair. <laughs> Why are you rapping Danny Brown songs right now? I'm getting box braids with that 25 bucks I'm gonna win. Dude, <laughs> you can't, <laughs> you shouldn't get box braids no matter how much they cost. Well, they wouldn't cost me anything, they'd be free. <laughs> you know what, do what you want. Nice, where'd you go? I'm at six nine now. I'm just having fun with it. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> This is kind of nice, though, because in this round, at least when you lose, you lose. Right. Like When you're by yourself, decide, yeah. Grant was just giggling and laughing, frothing at the mouth at one point, at my own frustration. Totally. I said, Grant, please give me a hint. And he said, <laughs> like a rabid pit bull. You got two moves to get there. Bobby Schmurda. <laughs> hey. <laughs> yep. Yep, yep, yep. All Rich. right. Check West. Nice. And that's 14. Yep. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. My score doesn't matter. I asked Grant for the answer. Right here, though, is the shortest path. Eminem to Post Malone to Khalid to Black Bear to Youngblood to Falling in Reverse. Isn't that weird? That is a weird one. Khalid in there is weird. When, when you started on Post Malone, I, I remembered it being the right one. I was like, oh, here he goes. It's now two to one you, despite all of your frustration, all of your rage, all of your... Despite all my rage, I am still just a rat in the cage. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a fucking rat, bro. I'll never snitch on you. Despite how much you fucking piss me off. Grant, who do I got now? Future to Phoebe Bridgers. Oh, that's a walk in the park. What's the number to beat? 20. No, I gotta be calculated here. I gotta so what's your method here? What are you trying to do? Oh, well, run and gun offense. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta get to a vocalist, and then I gotta get to... Well, the future is a vocalist. Right, but... Did you forget the word singer? God, dude, you're so patronizing when you're talking to me today. It's crazy. <laughs> it's like, what did I do? All I've done is give this game my all. You asked for my strategy, I said vocalist, and now I'm a piece of shit loser. How does that make me feel? How am I supposed to feel? I sat down here, and the first thing you said to me is, you look like a little bitch. <laughs> Some That's people like that. Not me. You know me. You know I don't like that. Sorry, you look like a big bitch. Thank you. That's <laughs> fine. I got a lot of rappers in here, obviously. I feel like I could go Metro, because he's a producer. Let's go Metro, Boomin. And let's go back to future. I'm just kidding. <laughs> back to the future. Yeah. Oh, oh. <laughs> it's a movie. Yeah. From the 80s. Michael J. Fox. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go Don Tolliver. See? There's a singer. And now I could go internet money. I like the <laughs> internet money. It's not going to get me closer to Phoebe Bridgers, would it? Stop looking at us I for visuals. My clues. eyes are darting around the room. I'm not looking at anyone in particular. I'm either going to go Sway Lee or Internet Money. Wh Grant, which one do you think is the best no, one? No, you can't ask oh. Grant okay. that. Sorry, I didn't know. It's a new game. I don't know the rules. I'll go Sway Lee. Darting around the room, by the way, super dangerous. Oh, yeah. Just do one dartboard and keep it in one enclosed area, I feel like. <laughs> Mike Will made it or Ty Dolla Sign? I'll go Ty Dolla Sign. Man, you got here in 20. 20 is starting to seem pretty good, honestly. <laughs> 20 is starting to seem real good. Do I go August Alcina, who I don't know who they are? <laughs> or do I go Do I go Mike Will Made It? I'll go Mike Will Made It, because maybe I can get the Miley Cyrus. <laughs> yeah, I forgot about the bangers era. Oh, that seemed to be a bad move. <laughs> That was a wrong, that was a wrong turn. <laughs> Yikes, let's go designer. Yeah, I'm fucked. I'm gonna go Fetty Wap. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> a woman appears. <laughs> Huzzah! <laughs> Dej Loaf. <laughs> Dej Loaf, yeah. Sure, sure, sure. Detroit, sure. shout out Detroit. And all of her related artists are men. <laughs> right. And none of them are little white girls who play guitar. <laughs> so I feel like I'm far off. I'm doing the August Alcina thing. Sure. These are some singers, some real singers. I got Omarion, I got Lloyd, I got The Dream. I'm gonna go Omarion. Okay, kind of what I thought. Older R&B here. And Jamie Foxx is there as well. Jamie Foxx is honestly one of the greatest musicians of all time. You got Genuine there too. I do, and I just wanna click him because I love him so much. Ah, I'll do it. Shout out Genuine. Oh, uh, gives you yikes. three artists. Yeah, three. Jagged Edge, Tyrese, and Pretty Ricky. <laughs> all right, I'll go Jagged Edge. <laughs> It's just Tyrese and Genuine. 
I'll go Tyrese. Let's go. Oh, oh. <laughs> good edge and genuine. Whoa, you are in an inescapable hole. I'll go genuine. I'll try pretty Ricky out. I'll try the dream out. I'm coming up on. Yep, I am fucked. Let's go, Jamie Fox. Ah, shit. It's all of me. Ah, shit, guys. You gotta go Omarion. That's the only one you haven't done. I've done Omarion. Now we're gonna go with Mario, and I gotta get it in this next one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ashanti. Damn it. All right, you beat me. So the quickest path there was eight, and it did start with Metro. I was right there. Then it goes Baby Keem, Denzel, Amine, Jaden, Willow, Claro, Mother. <laughs> So it's two to two. It is a grudge match. <laughs> now you're getting into some of my fun numbers here. I'm just excited to hear what you got on them. Because I was all the way across the office, as far away from this room as I could possibly be, and I still heard yelling. I don't think I'm done yelling either. No, I hope you yell some more. <laughs> Definitely going to yell when I get my belly button pierced tonight. You're getting it pierced tonight? Yep. Who's doing it? Some satanic ritual kingpin. That makes sense. Yeah. I heard all the stories turned you down. Yeah. They said they'd never seen a belly button like that. Yeah, I'm going to an underpass with a goat or something. Something later. Are you excited? Or? Yeah, I'm stoked. He's yeah. doing it with a railroad tie, though, and I just don't want all my insides <laughs> to fall out. Right. But I think it'll be sick when it's done. Yeah, you have been talking about how you want to make, like, minor aesthetic changes right. to kind of liberate your soul yeah. and express yourself. Mm -hmm. And I do feel like that would be a nice touch. Yeah. Yeah. It's like finally you're doing something for you. you I know, know, exactly. It's like all the stuff you do for other people, and then exactly. finally you're making a decision for you. And you know what? I finally bought the charcoal toothpaste. I don't care if people judge me. Personally, I think it looks gross. Yeah, it does. But I like that. Yeah. Makes me feel like a demon in the morning, like a monster. <laughs> you know what? Just a couple days ago, I yeah. feel like I would have totally judged you, right. dug into you, all that stuff. You've grown. But now I'm like, you know what? Go for it. You've grown a lot too. It's, As I've grown, your support for me has grown too, which I think is great. Like an inch and a half, yeah. Which is weird. Mm -hmm. Because at this age, you're not supposed to grow. No. But yeah, my yeah. doctors say it's a medical anomaly. That's good. And they said it might be because I never went through puberty. Right. And so now they feel like I might be starting. Nice. But I just don't see it. Personally, I haven't been experiencing anything that would suggest that I'd be going through puberty at this yeah. very late age that I am at now. You can, know? You, can you come now? <laughs> Still not? That'll, not it'll not get now. Huh. <laughs> Just not turned on. Oh, really? Yeah. Does that help? Stop doing that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's his thing. He that's, loves that. It's one of my things. He loves and it. I just right, do the fucking matchup. Great. What's the matchup? Michael Jackson to Papa Roach. This one is going to hurt me. What's the score to beat? 90. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! I love it. I have trauma just thinking about this one. Also, when you do this game, by the way, if you go to make a custom matchup, you type the first artist and you try to type another artist after and it doesn't show up, that means it's impossible. It only lets you do possible matchups. Good luck, man. Thanks. All right, so I got to get to some rock stuff, but I got to get some modern stuff, really, is the For thing. For sure. All right, I got Wham, I got George Michael, I got Queen. Yeah, Queen's in there. Madonna. Madonna's definitely in there. I got Prince as well. Prince is definitely. Prince is there. I'm going to go with George Michael. Ah, you got Rick Astley. You got Duran Duran. You oh. got Lionel Richie, Annie Lennox. I'm going to go with Seal. I'm going to sneeze. <laughs> God bless you. I'm going Lenny Kravitz. Lenny! <laughs> <laughs> he is sexy for how old he is. He's always been hot. That's one thing about him. <laughs> okay. We go with you too. Nice, I did that too. I went down this path too. <laughs> <laughs> that does not make me feel good. I do not want to follow in your footsteps. I'm going to keep sneezing too. I bet you will. I'm going to keep fucking sneezing. The police. <laughs> nice, I did that too. Fuck them though, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, fuck the police. Yeah, totally. I'm going to go in excess. Nice, I didn't. I never went down here. Billy Idol. Sure, everyone thinks that one makes sense. Especially me. <laughs> Pat Benatar. Oh, no, I did not. I did not. Ario Speedwagon, Foreigner, Starship Sticks. Um, I'll do Heart. That didn't help. The cars. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Riley. You can do oh, this, man. Cheap trick. Yeah, that you'd think. Yeah. <laughs> sure would. God damn. You'd think that cornball 80s stuff could like parlay you into butt rock. Wow, I'm lost. I basically just gotta like, it's such a high number that I'm gonna mess around a little bit, which I know it's probably not a good move, but I'm going Huey Lewis in the news. Oh, I did that too, man. <laughs> I hate that you're doing this to me, that you're just telling me that it's wrong. I wanna get there on my own. I don't think there's a right way to do it. <laughs> 
I'm so congested out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah, I could tell. I think I'm just broken up about stuff. About it's the that. news. It's not the news. <laughs> it's the news, man. <laughs> the horrors. Where'd you go there? Uh, the Doobie Brothers. You tried to sneak one by us there, didn't you? No. It's yeah, just, you did. It's just you're talking so much I'm and sneezing not doing so that much. much talking. You're talking and sneezing so much that it's hard to do my commentary. I'm not sneezing. I'm sniffling because the news is tragic. That's not why. <laughs> yes, it is. It's just not. Dude, you can't tell me which emotions of mine are not valid and which ones are valid. Right now, I'm feeling particularly broken up due to the vicious and tragic news I've been reading all day. I don't, okay. Tom Petty. Yeah, <laughs> you'd think. <laughs> <laughs> Give wow. him a Joe Walsh while you're at it. I did the traveling Wilburys. Okay, that opens up a few new doors. <laughs> <laughs> Is this what Jackson Brown looks like now? Now, yeah. What the fuck? Why he does he look liberal. like that? <laughs> he looks stupid and He's liberal. always been liberal. Don't click on George Harrison. What I'm the I'm going heck? to. It's very, very similar to Papa, Papa Roach. Roach. Papa Roach is in George Harrison's related artist. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Grant. Sorry. What the Jesus. He's squeaking his shoes back there. He's got the new Trump sneakers on and they're made of fake leather. That's they true. Squeak. They squeak a lot. Let's go with the monkeys. <laughs> nope. That gives me two related artists. Yep. Uh oh, I'm stuck here. The yard birds. Please yeah. save me. Cream. There you go. Rock and roll. Okay. The kinks. Now you're on the right track. The who? The what? What'd you pick? Don't do that. Ooh. Jimi Hendrix. There you go. Rock and roll. Only 60 more guesses to go, Riley. Black Sabbath. Okay, he's on to something. Yep, I think I can get there now. I gotta get to this, like, faux metal shit through all this actual metal shit, you I got think. It. So, gonna go with Slayer. Yeah. Oh. Pantera. For sure. Is this the band that had the supercharged lemonade? Supercharged lemonade? Lamb of God? Oh, mm. you're right on it. Uh, I feel like it's gonna be getting bullet for my Valentine's related artists is going to have, it's so close yeah. now. I am gonna go with- You're tiptoeing on God's dick. <laughs> <laughs> Avenge Sevenfold. Oh, yeah. you'd think it'd be in there. So close. It's gonna be in All one of these pictures. Two. <laughs> the same. These pictures look exactly the same. White it's like dudes in sketchy outfits. <laughs> it's five white dudes in jackets with their hands in their pockets, but their thumbs are out. <laughs> <laughs> if you're cold, they're cold. Put them inside, boys. I'm going Breaking Benjamin. Fuck yeah! You are all over this shit, man. Papa Roach. Woo! Are you a cold ass motherfucker, dude? Thanks, man. You are a bad boy. 39 guesses. Yeah. Oh, it was tough. I understand your frustration. Thank you. This is possible in five guesses? Yeah. yeah. Michael Jackson to Queen to Guns N' Roses to Metallica to System of a Down to Papa Roach. Here's the crazy thing. It took me 90 and I went Queen, Guns N' Roses were my first two moves. Whoa. And then I just I put myself in a Swedish headlock. It was fucked up, dude. I almost, I almost, I almost walked out during that one. I could see that. Well, charred kale and a bucket of beans. That was a tough one. Charred kale and a bucket of beans. What do you say, kids? How about me? There you go. Pump that shit up. Pump. Oh. It's that time of year again to discover your new signature scent. And there's no better way to do that than with our sponsor, Scentbird. And when I put on a new cologne, it just gives me that boost of confidence. And with Scentbird, I get to try new ones every single month. You know which scent I'm going crazy for right now? Oh, please tell me. It's Red Dakota by Dead Cool. I knew it would be. This one's fresh and zesty. It's unmistakably optimistic. <laughs> It smells like Mediterranean citrus groves with notes of gardenia, woods, amber, and wild berries. Yes! What's your favorite? I am so glad you asked. <laughs> I gotta go with Ice by Zero Icon. <laughs> oh, tell us more, that sounds interesting. Icon Ice is a fragrance for the modern man who wants to leave a lasting mark everywhere he goes. It's got notes of bergamot, grapefruit, musk, cedar, and amber. Oh, it sure does, man. It's delectable. <laughs> mm. You smell like a modern man. And since Scentbird is a fragrance subscription service, you can try a wide variety of scents before you figure out which one fits your personality and style the best. For only $17 a month, you can try a bunch of 30-day supplies before deciding if you want to buy that full-size bottle. So make sure you click the link below and visit Scentbird's website or scan the QR code and use code 55HIVEMIND for for 55% off your first month subscription at Scentbird. That's only about $8 for your first month if you use code 55HIVEMIND. That's 55HIVEMIND at Scentbird's website. Thank you, Scentbird, for sponsoring this video and keeping us smelling so good. Mm-mm-mm. Don't know where I'd be without you. Probably stinky. Thank you, Scentbird. Let's get back to the video. Grant, my friend, what is my journey? Bo Burnham. Ugh. 
to City Girls. <laughs> I typed in no Burnham. <laughs> that's, exactly- I, that's exactly what I did. I apologize. <laughs> oh my God, we are twins. I did it again. We're twins again. Ew, dude. <laughs> what? I was going to headbutt Who you. Who are you apologizing to? The Bo Burnham fans? Bo Burnham to City Girls. God, what a collab. The number to beat. Eight. Bo Burnham has two related artists. So this first move is crucial. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what either of them sound like. Cave Town or Mother Mother. I didn't know there were two Phoebe Bridgers. <laughs> <laughs> Mother Mother's a group, but they look Christian or something. City Girls is going to be so not, so not Christian. I'll go Cave Town. Okay. Bo Burnham comes up again. Beach Bunny is here. <laughs> Mitski is also here. Girl in Red. I'm going to go Beach Bunny. Be Bad Doobies here. So is Claro. The magnificent Claro is here. We all love her. Everyone loves Claro. Especially the fellas. All right, I'm leaning Biba Doobie or Claro. Which one would you go with? I already did it. Yeah. I did the game, so I, I can't really hint to you. I'm gonna go Doobie. I'm gonna be the doobster. Okay. I got Pink Panthers here. I feel like I gotta go there. Oh, I'm, I'm on your ass, bro. I'm gonna go Ice Spice. She's a bad bitch. <laughs> and then City Girls. And I, st- I stepped on your cock, bro. <laughs> it's three to three. Yeah. That's the shortest path. Yeah, I did that shit. I stomped you out like a roach, cuz. <laughs> it turns out Bo Burnham to City Girls, pretty easy. <laughs> yeah, kind of like two doors down, really. Yeah. <laughs> Electric ball game today. It is. 25 bucks to get box braids. <laughs> you can't. You're grading. I know, I'm getting all. dignan box braids. Because you said I can't. So yeah. we might as well get him them. I mean, he could get away with which is fucked up. He just has like the facial structure for it. And he lived in Barbados for like 16 years. Yeah, but he wasn't up to any good. Okay. He, not all he people... robbed the good people of Barbados blind. Right. But not all people with braids are good either. I know that, but it's yeah. not like that should add to like his good graces of getting box braids no good graces just a guy getting box braids right a bad guy getting box then braids. why did you mention him living in barbados for 16 years it's just something he did he's part of the island culture no he's not well kind of not a good part of it the robin part yeah he didn't i don't i don't think that's any gives any credence to the box braids thing credence schmedence dude sorry i didn't mean to say that that came off a little harsh no. i shouldn't have said schmedence i'm better than that Thank you. And that's gross. And that's gross. That's gross. <laughs> that is gross. I kind of like it. <sighs> all right, Grant, what's the fuss all about? Skrillex to Bob Dylan. Okay, and what's the score here? 80. This one was supremely frustrating as well. Because I thought to myself, <laughs> finally, the end person here, I'm so familiar with their music that I felt like there'd be a bunch of winding roads that I could end up there. Right. Turns out there's a lot of shit-ass DJs with high-top fades. <laughs> With names I've never heard. And I was just trying to find one motherfucker who played an instrument. <laughs> and that took me about 33 moves. <laughs> to find think... a guy outside of a V-neck who wasn't back to back with a similar looking motherfucker <laughs> who just fucking plays big ass EDM drops. It took me a fucking good fucking goddamn part of the day to find <laughs> one person. It was Nick Jonas. I found Nick Jonas. <laughs> And then that didn't fucking help because fucking that led me. Yeah, it's bullshit. Do you think that this game has turned you into a curmudgeon? Read me some of these names. Go ahead. (laughs) Just read them. Dead Mouse. Fine. Jack (laughs) U. I'm just making sure you didn't want to add anything there. Off. Yep, go ahead. <laughs> Diplo? Terrible. Bad guy, yeah. Dylan Francis? I like Dylan Francis. Yeah, he went to your high school. Steve Aoki? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like moist critical. <laughs> I guess from really far away. Squint your eyes. <laughs> Hold your phone sideways. <laughs> Is that Steve Aoki or moist critical? <laughs> um, I think I'm going to put like a really sick drop here. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to go on reading them, but you'll get two in and you'll see the type of freaks I was talking about. Yeah, I'm going to go with Swedish House Mafia first. Now look what we're doing yeah, here. Yeah, okay. We got Don Diablo, Afro Jack, Nicky Romero, <laughs> Alesso, Axwell and Grosso. A lot of black tees, a lot of sunglasses. I'm going to go with Tiesto. That didn't help. I mean, it's the same people. Yeah. Literally the same people. Yeah, this is going to be frustrating, I can already tell. It's like a <laughs> fucked up Vegas conference, and you're looking for Bob Dylan. <laughs> he ain't there, buddy. Yeah. You're not finding Bob Dylan in Hakkasan. Yep, I'm going back all the way to Diplo, because at least... He's old. Yeah, there's something. No, there's not, though. I'll go to Jack U. I don't know. I, I'm got to claw my way out of here. I went to Galantis, or I don't know how to pronounce it. Going to Dubs. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Cashmere. Nope. Rehab. 
Yep. <laughs> yeah. Hard well. You're going to find yourself clicking every one, buddy. A lasso. Mm-hmm. Zed. That might help. We all thought it would. Cruella. Back to Zed. <laughs> <laughs> we went with Jonas Blue. There you go. You're close now. Don't, I don't, dude, I don't do that. You're I don't close. like when you do this. I'm like the away crowd, dude. I know, but it's <laughs> fucking annoying. <laughs> I don't want to know when I'm close. That's the whole point of playing the game. You're not close. That's why I said it. I'm playing mind games with you. I know, but I don't want to know whether I'm close or not. You That's... won't know because you don't know if I'm lying or if I'm telling the truth. Nobody ever knows if you're lying or telling the truth. Dick shit. Dick shit? <laughs> Comment dick shit down below if you think I should keep hassling Riley. Okay. <laughs> Look at that. A flood of comments. I'm not looking at the comments. It's bad for my mental health. That's what my therapist told me. Okay, where are you going next, buddy? I clicked cheat codes. Hell yeah. Now I'm going to click Martin Jensen. We've all been down the Jensen road. <laughs> Let me tell you what, buddy. I'm Ain't I, shit down it. I clicked loud luxury. <laughs> mm -hmm. Medusa. Becky Hill. Okay. Ooh, now I got some names of just like women I've never heard of. Ella Henderson. That Jess Glynn. Rita Ora. Finally. A vocalist. Ellie Golding. You should be shot with a Go gun. with Zed again. Get back to the Zed base. That's base camp for you. No. Home okay. base is Zed. <laughs> <laughs> I clicked on Kesha, and now I'm getting to Christina Aguilera. Nelly Furtado. Ooh, yes, I'm so close now. It's just awesome. I clicked on Natasha Bedingfield. Now I've got Colby Calais yeah. and Sarah Bareilles, which I feel like I'm going Sarah here. Oh, yeah, here we go. We got Gavin DeGraw, Jason Mraz. Jason Mraz is definitely the play. <laughs> well, I clicked on him, and then I got John Mayer. Oh, Mayer is, like, not that far removed. Dave Matthews. Oh, Ray LaMontagne, actually, is going to get me there, I think. I thought Ray LaMontagne was my golden ticket to paradise. <laughs> I'm going Leon Bridges here. Didn't go there. Seems like the wrong move. Maggie Rogers. Fuck, you're close. <laughs> I got Casey Musgraves on this. God damn it. She might as well be Bob Dylan. <laughs> <laughs> Miranda Lambert. Oh, shit. Slow down. <laughs> <laughs> Reba McIntyre. No, don't click her. <laughs> <laughs> don't do it. If Faith Hill. If these walls could talk. Leanne Rhymes. Oh, hell no. You're getting changled up. Yeah, Reba McIntyre. Only uh, 50 more that. guesses. Martina McBride. Ooh, I'm stuck in a hole. There's nowhere to go here now. I'm fully stuck. Show off how the reset button works. I don't want to do that. Well, if you're stuck, what are you going to do? It's just the same people. Ah! Cycling. There's an Reba hole. No, I got to Sugarland. We're good. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> Little Big Town. Nice. You are close, man. I can feel it. Ooh. I got a lot, a lot going on here. Lady A is probably close too. But I also got Darius Rucker and Dirks Bentley. That's got to be close. Darius Rucker just got arrested for weed. <laughs> just now? Yep, right now. No, oh no. He said, come bail me out. I said, Darius, I don't have fucking time, bro. I got to go to bed. Why'd you lie? You're doing a video. I like lying. It makes me feel like I'm in control. Why are you just being vulnerable right now? Toby Keith. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. Toby Keith. <laughs> Kenny Chesney. I'm stuck. I don't know. Brad Paisley. Oh, you're right there, man. <laughs> you are deep in modern 2000s country. <laughs> Rascal Flats. Right on. <laughs> Nothing wrong with little Rascal Flats. I like Rascal Drums, too. And I'm a Rascal if you give me some flats. You like what I'm working with or no? I love it. Okay. Carrie Underwood. Carrie Underwood, <laughs> so good. I like her tunes, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't even know if I'm going to get there ever. Yeah. 80's not such a bad number after all, huh? Ugh, fuck. This is awful. Who's Rodney Atkins? You don't know who Rodney Atkins is? I don't think so. Fucker. Kit Moore. No, you're just fucking around. Randy Hauser. Hey. Brett Eldridge. All right. Cole Swindell. Oh, he's got that one song. Tales Carolina, heads California. Bam, 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 bam. Lee Bryce. You are buried in a country fucking death pit over here. I kind of like it over here. Crack me a white claw, bun, man. I think I'm going to go to therapy after this. <laughs> Physical therapy. I think you should. You seem stiff. I am in a lot of pain. I think you're going to win this round. I'm at 70 and I'm nowhere near. I can't believe I'll get a win with 80. The fastest route, though, is 82, so... <laughs> I actually did pretty well, considering. <laughs> I'm just around all these young country guys that are, like, buff and dumb. Nothing wrong with that, man. It's fine, but, like, I don't... Nothing wrong with being buff and dumb. I was already here. I'm just retracing my steps. 
I like Bob Dylan. I deserve to win this round. You don't deserve that. I deserve a lot of things. Love and affection. Support from my closest friends. And a corgi named Janice who wear, has to wear shoes because she has sensitive paws because I rescued her from a puppy mill. She lived her whole life in a cage. Her long nipples sag and scratch the pavement. Those are just a few of the things I deserve. And I deserve a smoke break. Uh, ooh, I'm just going to... 77. Keith Urban. Rest in... Purban. He's alive. Go on. Tim McGraw. What if I just got oh, no, 80? Is I hit 80. Yeah. Let's go. All right. The shortest path here is Skrillex to Dead Mouse, to Pendulum to the Prodigy, to Portishead to Nick Cave and the Bad Seeds, to Leonard Cohen to Bob Dylan. Wow. We're trading blows here, buddy. You know what's interesting is like when I'm in the room doing them alone, I didn't experience that same frustration that you did. Yeah. But when you're here, I brought it in. Oh, my blood is boiling. The black, the and black I, I, death. Yeah, I don't really like show it that much, but yeah. like the the way that you were talking to me during that, I couldn't even engage with bits because I was so angry. <laughs> yeah, I want to gnaw you like a corn on the cob, pal. I literally thought about, are there bones at all right here? Could I rip out a small one without killing you? By just grabbing your neck and ripping one out. Yeah, but your hand couldn't fit around my neck. Grant, could you stop recording for a second? <laughs> Your anger calms me, which is nice. It's four to three, you. I could really shut the door here, quite literally. Yeah, actually. Shut the door, don't shut it on me. Grant, what's my journey? Hesha to a tribe called Quest. Oh, that's so easy. The number to beat? 26. Lord have mercy on your soul. <laughs> All right. I got Iggy Azalea. She raps a lot. So does Will I Am. But Will I Am is nowhere near a tribe called Quest. He's like future man. Do I go <laughs> Iggy or do I go Will? Or do I go Fergie? Fergie's got bars. <laughs> yes, bars. I'll go Iggy. Why not? Let's have some fun today. <laughs> Loosen up, dude. <laughs> All that being said, I will go with Will. I am after that. <laughs> And now we are into the money zone. I feel like I'm only about two away. <laughs> we have Bob here and Jay Sean. It's B O B. What's that spell? What does it spell, Riley? <laughs> it's fine if I say Bob. And it's fine if I call the black eyed peas Beb. <laughs> it's just cool. And I went with the peas there. And now, wow, I am so close. It's crazy. L M F A O. Timbaland's here, but I remember from one of mine clicking Timbaland pulled up like two people, and I think one of them was Jeff Bezos. <laughs> so I don't think that's gonna help. Flo Rida could help, but he's so damn muscular, it freaks me out. <laughs> he's too big to be a rapper. Justin Timberlake's here. He's is he is white. Probably not gonna pick on him. Or I pick on him. I'm not gonna pick him. I'm not saying I wouldn't pick on him because he's white. That's fucked up. Why would I say that? I'm not going to pick on him like like I'm about to pick on Timbal in here. No, nah, like that. Oh, Jesus Christ. The devil himself. Diddy's here. <laughs> <laughs> Lucifer incarnate is in here. And I think I remember LL Cool J from another one pulled up one related artist, and it was Miss Frizzle from the, my <laughs> magic school bus. <laughs> so I'm not going to be picking on him. Nelly Furtado, a beautiful woman. <laughs> Such a beautiful lady. Missy Elliott kind of feels right. Ludacris is way too vulgar and I hate his music. So I'll go with Missy Elliott. Ah, <laughs> oh, not a great one. 26 though. I feel like I got time to fuck around. Though. Let's just see who LL Cool J's is. See what I mean? Ah, oh, but Naughty by Nature's here. And I feel like, God damn it, that feels close. And I'm going to choose them. Oh, and just, <laughs> there we go. It's just LL Cool J. <laughs> The only musician to ever sound like Naughty by Nature <laughs> is LL Cool J. <laughs> Moving back. I'll go Ja Rule. He pulls up a few artists, a few new ones here. There's that magical twist a button. I hate how Diddy's in all red in his photo. It's fucking weird, man. He's the devil. <laughs> Fat Joseph? I remember clicking on Twisted 2 and there was only like one related artist and I think it was a box turtle. I think it was just a, yeah, I'm pretty sure it was just what? a box turtle. I don't know how that makes sense. It's what they said, I don't know. Maybe the game's still in beta or something. Do I have to try Ludacris now? Lil' Kim's old though. I'll go with Kimothy. Fuck! That sent me back into the shits, man. Think, Graydon. Do I wanna go the Ashanti route? Probably not. I'm gonna go Missy Elliott again. Bitch, I'm gonna have to do it. I don't, 
I, I clicked the devil. That didn't even help. What a waste of a click. Show me Fat Joe. Shit, man, I'm getting kind of close here. Let's go Lloyd Banks. No, why would I do that? Uh, maybe I should, though. I remember clicking on Fab, too, and there was only, like, two related artists there, and it was, like, a yellow and a green Skittle <laughs> for the two <laughs> artists. And so I'm not gonna... <laughs> I don't think those will help me. And I remember thinking it was weird. It was weird as fuck. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that would be surprising to me. Bow Wow's related artist is a Werther's original. <laughs> what the heck? I, again, it is, it's in early stages. Yeah. They'll fix the kinks, I think. The kinks, though, they're related artists. Was the Pepperidge Farm moose. <laughs> what the heck? And then when I clicked on the monkeys, I remember their related artist was just a convertible from the 70s. Right, a nice one. <laughs> and it literally just said, a convertible, a convertible from the 70s, <laughs> dot, 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 a nice one. Generic. Ugh, Lloyd Banks feels so wrong, dude, but I'm going to click it. Fuck, it's just fab, and now I'm gonna click fab, and now it's just the two Skittles. And I gotta go back to Fat Joe, because I was just at Lloyd, and now I'm running out of time. I only have 10 guesses to get to... Who am I going for? A tribe called Quest. Right, I thought I was looking for a Heath bar. <laughs> Bow Wow's not gonna get me there, that son of a bitch. <laughs> We're going back to Diddy. Fuck, what was Lil' Kim's? I'm losing my memory! Lil' Kim again. Shit, Missy Elliott again. Oh, I, ran, I ran into a brick wall. Timbaland again. Okay, this is kind of where I have to go. I have to get this in five, and I'm back at Timbaland, who I was at 10 fuck damn guesses ago. <laughs> Ludicrous. I didn't go down this hole. Busta Rhymes. Busta Nut. Shit, this is going to piss me off, man, because I am feel like I'm close. I'm going to go Method Man. Or go Mob Deep. Oh, God. Most Deaf. I have to get it in this one, right? Fuck. The Roots. I would feel like I was close. De La Soul, Tribe Called Quest. Oh. 27. Oh. Let's go. Oh. Fuck. Hey, that is primetime television, though. Yeah. Damn, dude. I made so many mistakes. I had to double back like three times. Yeah. Motherfucker. <laughs> not, not you. I'm no, like I understand. Exclaiming. Yeah. Bitch. <laughs> the shortest path was six. And it goes Kesha to Will I Am to Bob to Lupe Fiasco to Most Deaf to The Roots to a Tribe Gold Quest. <laughs> it is four to four. This is awesome, man. I like this new game, but God, is it is it a fucking you know what I'm gonna say. Nightmare. 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 What's up? You're watching High Mind the most. most, most, most. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a fucking nightmare, man. I'm sweating. I'm pissed. Can we gallivant soon? No. We haven't been gallivanting. We're going on tour. Summer. What do you think that's going to be? It's not going to be gallivanting. Bitch, watch me. I bought white boots. <laughs> it's not going to be like frolicking. Yeah, it will be. I don't feel like it will. We used to gallivant. No, we did not. We used you got, to run. You have a fucked up version of the past that is just fucked up. The sunshine. We'll sing in the sunshine. Yeah, we did. We had some good days, man. We'll bathe in our pit. Yeah, we didn't do that once. It's all right, dude. The past is the past. We can't live like that anymore. We're grown men with families. We don't have families. I do. What do you mean? I have a family of mice living in my bed. One's in my butt. You know what? I don't give a rat's ass about your family. That's fine. I up, want right? to gallivant. No more gallivanting for we me. We have to gallivant. No, I'm going to put a fucking owl in your closet tonight. I love owls. Not this one. He's a dick. <laughs> or he has a dick. He has a very human looking dick. <laughs> and it is fucked up. Well, yeah, don't, then don't do that. I'm going to do it. But why? Because I'm trying to fucking fuck with you, man. You're driving me insane. I want revenge. Weren't you already insane? I feel like. No, I you pushed me off a cliff. I was on a normal path, man. It's going to be in prison by 30, probably dead by 30. I was on the, I was on the righteous path. That's not the righteous path. And you drag me in here, make me fucking play relatable until I fucking lose my fucking marbles, dude. I'm gonna knock your screws out and put an owl with a big human dick in your closet <laughs> in the middle of the fucking night, and then I'm gonna bang on your door, and that fucker is gonna go berserk. He'll start flying around. <laughs> he freaks out. He doesn't want to be in the house. He's an owl. I'll let the family of mice loose in your house, and he's gonna go crazy over those things. He start ripping them up. You're gonna be in a fucking horror movie. You'll be living in hell, man. The big cock owl. <laughs> <laughs> whipping around in your house, devouring mice that are my family. You're gonna be like, what the fuck? And you're gonna try and run out the front door and I'm gonna have it barricaded. By the time you break down the door, I'm gonna have that strip of nails out there that the cops use to blow the tires off criminals on the run. And you're gonna step on those. Fuck your feet up. That's how I'm gonna do it tonight. And that's because you knocked me loose. You <laughs> fucked me up, man. You pushed me off the cliff. Listen. Yeah. If I'm driving you insane, then you owe me gas money. <laughs> 
See what I mean? This is. I think after you step on the nails, I think I'm just gonna shoot you <laughs> from a distance. I'm just gonna. If I'm driving you insane. You owe me gas money. Yeah, I'm gonna put one right yeah. through your heart, so you can still have an open casket. But I'm gonna put one through your chest. <laughs> I had a few people DM me asking if they could buy crows, by the way. I got you. How many do they want? The bow goes only on the grackles. No, I know that. Uh, it was about five different people. It okay. looked like they were looking for individual crows. African or Polynesian? Uh, three Polynesian, one African, and then the last person couldn't decide and then asked if you had a sweet and sour one. <laughs> you know what I do for fuckers like that? Huh. I spray paint a grackle pink. Why would that help? People that want sweet and sour, like that motherfucker probably owns a Labradoodle. Oh, so you give them like a cute bird and say it's a... Here's your sweet and sour crow. They don't even exist. <laughs> oh, really? Can't I buy them domestically. Because, see, to me, that person didn't seem fancy. They seemed hungry. If you want to eat a crow, be my guest. This is not about me. This is a person in my DMs. No, I'll get them a sweet and sour crow. No problem. Respond to all of them. Tell them to meet me at the underpass. I'll take care of everyone tonight. All right. The most, 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 most kind of a do or die moment here, Grant. What's my matchup? Dua Lipa to Lil Xan. I love this. <laughs> <laughs> I did too. And what is the number? 71 with two resets. Not bad. <laughs> Where are you going first? Uh, Probably BB Rexa. I am going to start with Camila Cabello. And then I am going to get to Halsey. I'm actually, I know this is retreading, but I have a hunch. And I'm going to go with Demi Lovato. Demi, I did that too. <laughs> Zendaya's on there. It's true. I am going to go Zendaya. And that gives me just Sabrina Carpenter. Oh, she's crazy good. She is good. Olivia Rodrigo. All right. Let's do Melanie Martinez, yeah. which I hate to click her name, but I have to. Sometimes you got to do it, man. That gives me Chase Atlantic. Then I've got, I mean, the neighborhood's pretty good. I'm going to go there. Uh, that didn't help. I'll go Conan Gray. Hey, there's a Biba Doobie again. <laughs> hey, there's a Biba Doobie. <laughs> Hey, is Biba Doobie keeps popping up my Spotify. Is it worth a listen? That's like a guy from Queens. <laughs> <laughs> you just bumped into on the street. And he's hey, just, you're, in the, you're in the YouTube uh, business. Uh, this Biba Doobie keeps popping up my Spotify. Is it worth a listen? <laughs> <laughs> he just doesn't know how he feels about it. He, he thinks the name is intriguing. Yeah, and he but, hasn't bothered to go listen himself yet. He's but he's kinda, open-minded. He's asking around. Yeah. Hey, I was listening to Conan Gray, and, you know, I just went in there with Lady Artist, and the next thing I know, I see this Biba Doobie. Anything <laughs> worth there? Anything worth the checking out there? I don't want to waste my time, but I'm not against nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, I love Sabrina Carpenter, Olivia Rodrigo, Dua Lipa, all this stuff. So when I see the Biba Doobie, I'm like, yeah, it's a funny name, but is it worth checking out? <laughs> I didn't know if you're working in the YouTube business or anything. Do you know do you know anything about this Biba Doobie? I mean, sure, Gracie Abrams. I mean, she's great. I don't know. It's, it's, it's JJ. <laughs> it's JJ Abrams' kid, right? Yeah, it's JJ's daughter, but I don't really think about it as a nipple, right, baby. I think about like the a... music. Right, right. And sure, Claro's dad worked for Coca-Cola for a little bit. But it's so a little what? fucked up. Coca-Cola's kind of a fucked up business. Ever since they took the Coke out of the fucking original recipe, why the fuck are we drinking it? No good no more. No Every business is a fucked up business, all right? Yeah, but if you had cocaine in your product at one point and you take it away, that's fucked up. <laughs> I mean, God damn it, you were giving us the good stuff and you take it away. What do you want me to do now? Fucking fentanyl? God damn it, you want me to live under the underpass with the satanic guy who gives out belly button piercings with a railroad tie? <laughs> I'm just trying to fucking figure out. You work in the YouTube business. Should I listen to this Biba Doobie? <laughs> listen, if you like Girl in Red, you know, you like, uh, well, you ever heard of Sack of Mommy? I like Sack of Mommy. You like <laughs> Sack of Mommy? You got some if you tunes. like Sack of Mommy, I think you'll find something to like about Biba Doobie. I even fuck around with a little Cave Town from now and again. You know, and that's funny because Cave Town used to be a YouTuber himself. I am not that. Can yeah, you believe yeah. it? That's it's why like, I saw you. It's kind of a, yeah, it's a big circle of life. DJ said, Dime's a flat circle. Right. And you know what? My favorite flat circle is a big old pie for Martinelli's down fucking street. <laughs> I've been meaning to try Martinelli's. Is that what we're checking out? Yeah, Martinelli's. You're in the pie business, right? Yeah, and Martinelli's, he has, okay. Martinelli's, yeah, so Martinelli's is a, is a good place to check out. I'm going to mark that down. Oh, yeah. Fucking pie. <laughs> really good pie. One of the best pies on the block. You know, real pies on, making a pie. That's what you want. Uh, you got to excuse me. I'm getting a little sleepy. Hey, one last question before you drift off. They sell by the slice down there, or do I gotta buy a whole pie? In fucking Queens, what do you think you gotta buy a whole Just making sure it's a legit spot. Making sure it's a legit spot. It's starting to offend me, man. (laughs) Cool, cool. Uh, I'm gonna go with Gracie Abrams. Yeah, I bet you would. Dumbass. (laughs) 
I'll go with Tate McRae. God, she's electric on the dance floor, but yeah, not that great of a singer. I don't. I, I like I've some heard of some songs, recordings yeah. that are bad. That's sure. That's fine. Yeah. I'll go with Alec Benjamin. Alec Benjamin. Black Bear. I'm so close. For real. I've got Machine Gun Kelly on here. Poor <laughs> shit. I've got Arizona Zervis on here. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go Machine Gun Kelly. Fuck yeah, brother. Yellow Wolf. I love Yellow Wolf. <laughs> Ian Dior. Uh oh. Oh, you're right on top of it. Lil Skies. And Lil Xan. Pretty close, man. Wow, 18 guesses. Fastest route here was nine. <laughs> and it was Dua Lipa to Camila Cabello to Shawn Mendes to Five Seconds of Summer to Why Don't We to Bozzy to Benny Blanco to Ian Dior to yep. Lil Skies to Lil Xan. Makes sense. You did pretty good. Thank you. Yeah, that's really good. Don't say thank you like that. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, so weird. Thank so you. Weird. Going into the final one, you can tie it up here and we go to overtime. Or I could lose and you would win. Yes. I think we all know who really won here. Fucking brothers that made this game. I'm going to get so much Skrilla after this. <laughs> so much scratch. Yeah, the Relatal Brothers. Damn. <laughs> like the Filthy new, rich Relatal yeah. Brothers. Like the new Winklevoss. And you can, it says, uh, buy us a coffee at the bottom of it. So you have <laughs> a, you can kind of like donate to them on their site. And uh, I feel like the traffic is going to increase a bunch. The whole thing might crash. <laughs> Grant, just fucking tell me. Drake to Weezer. Drake to Weezer. Dreezer. Nine guesses. Oh, bitch. <laughs> Nine? Okay, Drake to Weezer. Holy shit, you're a nerd. <laughs> Holy shit, you're a nerd. You got it in seven. Oh, fuck me, dude. I got a nine. You got it in nine. I'm going to get it in seven. All right. This is an important first move. It's not a lot of wiggle room. That's what they'll say. None of these motherfuckers are anything like Weezer. <laughs> I, part of me wants to go to DJ Khaled, obviously, because he's collaborated with so many people that if I could maybe get, if I got like a Justin Bieber, does that get me any closer to Weezer than a Kendrick Lamar? Bitch, I don't know. <laughs> that makes more sense to me than any of these other sons of bitches. Metro, kind of in that same boat, but yeah, different. DJ Khaled, I'm going there. That didn't help. Did Weezer work with a rapper that I'm not remembering? They worked with Dominic Fike. Does he count? Fuck no, he doesn't fucking count. He was in Euphoria. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I feel like I've lost before I even tried. I'll go T-Pain. Pretty Ricky's on here. Sean Kingston's on here. Those Both those groups are a lot like Weezer. <laughs> Sean Kingston's a group. Did you know that? <laughs> That's not true. <laughs> yep. He's a guy. He's a guy who saw a pretty girl and wanted to commit nightmare because she was so hot. It's really unfortunate. He didn't do it though. That's what they want you to think. That's I mean, it's just pretty Ricky. Fuck, I'm back in the same bullshit. This is self. I'm resetting. <laughs> Weezer, where yet? Weez. <laughs> uh, I'll go Travis Scott. That's wrong. Fuck. Damn it. God damn it. ASAP Rocky. Oh, bitch. You bitch. Denzel Curry. Ah. Kids see ghosts. Amine. Okay, that's getting kind of closer. I'll go Amine. He opened up some doors for you earlier. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't shoo me away when you say me. Let's go Brockhampton. I already lost. Here I go fucking losing. God damn it. Brockhampton's just like Weezer. Let's go with the internet. Shit, man. Shit my ass. Thundercat. And there we go. I'm gone. <laughs> nice game, dude. Good game. So the fastest path was nine, which is what I got it in. Nice. I did not take this exact path, though. Kind of sucks you couldn't beat it. What? Sucks you couldn't beat nine. I mean, nine's great, but eight would have been better. <laughs> It's not possible, Nate. Not possible. You sound like the Russians in the 50s about the moon. That's what you sound like. You sound like a doubter and a non-believer. I think you could get it, Nate, dude, because I believe in you. You were really fucking good at this game, man. Now, this is something you could really put your mind to. You could be good at this. Really good. You are good at it. You could be great. <laughs> you really focused on this shit, dude? You could change the world. The fastest path was nine, and it says here, Kanye to Tyler to Mac to Marco, to Tame Impala, to MGMT, to Passion Piet, and Modest Mouse, and then Cake, and then Wheeze Wheeze. The Wheeze Train. And you beat me five to four. Six to four. Wow, oh my God, again. Again, with the correction stuff. It's like, when's it Well, it's stop? just, we did 10 rounds. I don't yeah. want people to, you know, the scoreboard says six, four. So I just feel like, just, oh, can I get sorry. something? It's over there. Yeah, you can get something. You can get 25 bucks. I got you. That's the most I've ever won in a hive mind game. Oh. 
that was the first ever game of Spotify related artist speed run. We want to thank the Kalani brothers for breaking Graydon's spirit down. For real. It was a lot of fun. Letting me <laughs> just kind of like chop it into a bunch of bits and it's, snort it. It's so cool that you guys made that. It's a feat of technology, a step for mankind, and it's super fucked up. Yeah, it's a mental torture device for people exactly like Graydon. Exactly like Graydon. Who? Strong and handsome? Yeah. Okay. So let us know if you like the new game. Also, check it out, Relatal.io. Play the daily ones and then make your own custom ones and comment them down below for Grant to search through for episode two. Yeah, episode two. <laughs> Coming soon. Woo! <laughs> and before the video ends, we have to once again thank our sponsor for today's video, Scentbird. Use code 55HiveMind to get 55% off your first month at Scentbird. Link in description, scan the QR code on the screen to get that. Thank you, Scentbird. Screaming deal. And lastly, Graydon, do you want to leave these wonderful people some advice to leave or live their lives by? Honestly, I'm good, but uh, I can do this. May the blood that spills from your enemies uh, orifices quench your everlasting thirst for revenge. All right, this has been iMind TV. We love you, appreciate you, and we'll see you in the next one. <laughs> We're done? We're done. Yeah, okay. This is horseshit. Share. I'm going with share and I'm trying to get to Papa Roach. <laughs> wow. Okay, I've got MGMT, the strokes, cage the elephant. <laughs> It has to stop. I'm gonna go Missy Elliott. No, you're definitely not rolling. This is the opposite of Molly. I'll show you Molly. <laughs> Molly who? <laughs> Molly Ringwald? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Woo! Sorry for cussing. <laughs> Tennessee! Wichita! Those are places. Nightmare. 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 Nightmare.